Hi everyone, I'm going to be showing you how I created this animated lightning bolt that's running through this text you see right here. Okay, let's get to it. Now we're going not to, going to be uh, creating text, just the lightning bolt effect. And the script is comes from a will script pack and it's lightning bolt. Now I've already set all the uh, variables here uh, but one important thing you want to uh, make note of is the uh, X and Y dimensions of your image have to be in reverse as you see here 750 by 300 and it says 300 by 750 so you want to put them in reverse if you understand my meaning because the script generates the lightning bolt vertically and not horizontally so we want we want the lightning bolt to go vertic go vertically. Okay? Now the color is 265, which is a purpley color. Now this slide corresponds to this seems to correspond to the uh, color hue and saturation filter that's used to change the color of stuff, so uh, that's how I know that that's purple. Okay? So, and the glow strength I set to 17. Everything else is pretty much default except the, I want uh, a transparent background. And I'm going to click OK and then pause and we'll be right back. OK, now we have our rendered lightning bolt. It's vertical, as you can see. And we're going to uh, go to Image Transform and we're going to rotate that clockwise. 90 degrees so it is vertical and once it's vertical we want to go and to our uh, layers over here and create a new layer for our background and right click there create new layer and I'm going to call it background layer or BG and transparent and click OK and to ensure that it's in the exact bottom position, I click the down green down arrow and the background is now on the exact bottom. And then I go to my text layer and select the background layer and copy that. Paste that into our lightning bolt animation. Make sure it's anchored. Of that. Now we want to combine these layers with the background. So what we do is we click Filters, Animation, Combine Background. And this will combine the, uh, the background with all the lightning bolt animation layers. Okay, now we have all our backgrounds integrated into our lightning bolt animation. We want to go down to our background, select it, and clear that because I'm going to put the text there. So we don't need that to be full of anything. And we go to our text layer, select that, and copy that, and then paste that into our background layer. And anchor it. And move it all the way up top so we can adjust its opacity uh, go yeah, well, one more time here we go okay here we go all right there we have it now I'm going to zoom in and adjust the opacity I think 85 should be pretty good yeah 85 is good now we bring it right back down. I just moved it up so I could see the lightning bolt through the text. Now we want to combine this text with the other layers. So we hit filter, animation, overlay background. And what this does is puts uh, the text layer above our background layers, combining them in 
to uh, what you'll see soon. Okay, we have our text layer, our background layer, all combined into one animation. And what we want to do is go down to the bottom layer and delete this background text layer because it's no longer needed. Oh, excuse me. And now um, filter, animation, playback, play. As you see, it came out pretty good. It's not hard to do. Thanks for watching, you guys. And also, I'd just like to thank everyone at Gimp Chat that helped jog my memory on how to use the uh, combined scripts for the animation. Have a, I was having a little uh, senior moment there. I'm sure you guys can identify with that. But thanks for watching.